Hello, I am Laura, and I am the founder of Excel AI. I'm on a mission to reduce the barriers to entry in understanding and engineering artificial intelligence. AI is set to replace thousands of people in every industry. Those affected most will be low-skilled and low-waged workers. That is why I'm developing the first accelerated program to help train AI engineers here in Oakland, to help them gain a sustainable career of the future. Well, as a project manager, I like to keep up with what's going on in the different areas that the software developers are using. I'm going to the intro track, and what I liked about it was that it didn't assume a lot of knowledge and background in this topic. Um, what I was amazed by this conference was the organization. It was so well organized. The sessions were very carefully planned. The speakers were very carefully selected. So that kind of created a more collaborative structure because because when you're in an intro level or if you're in an advanced level, you become more comfortable when asking questions. This was an important event for me. In fact, it's my favorite event of the year. I learned so much, not just about um, the technical aspects of AI and deep learning, but really about the people. If you have diverse perspectives, if you bring a culture where that's accepted, for there to be differing views, it makes it safe for all kinds of ideas, including the best ideas that one didn't even consider to bubble up to the surface. This workshop has been incredible in terms of the size, uh, the ability to ask um, the lecturers questions very quickly, uh, the interactivity that goes into learning. Um, it's not just that we're being lectured at, uh, it's actually participatory. The advantage to having face-to-face -face interaction is somebody will have um, a model for your understanding of the system and can tell you exactly which bits of information you need based on the content they already know that you understand. Um, there's this like, very strong difficulty in finding appropriate resources. So a million and one people will come to you asking, you know, is Andrew this Coursera course or should I read this textbook? And none of those resources are actually going to like, find the holes that are in your knowledge and like directly um, give you the information that you need. People are certainly sociable, which is a nice aspect. I actually had a couple of good interactions with a few people that were already here that are also researchers in the same field. Um, I hadn't planned on making that happen, but it just, you know, coincidentally, we were sitting in the same talk and we started talking about the things that we were working on afterwards and discovered that we ended up, we were running into problems in the same way or in a way that was kind of mutually beneficial. So you have people from academia, people from out of town, people from startups, people from energy companies, people from software backgrounds, people from hardware backgrounds. Trying to cross-pollinate or mingle with these folks is very difficult outside their technical area of expertise. So having a place where you actually run into them, they're there for the same purpose, they have the same interests, they want to learn the same subject, and then you can trade expertise in other ways. The networking opportunities are incredible. There are just so many people here that are working on just crazy projects, things that um, are just so up and coming and being able to talk with those people and hear more about what they're doing has been really cool. So you should visit excel.ai to sign up for the opportunity to engineer your future.